In Jujutsu Kaisen, there are people who have cursed energy and some that have none. The humans that use cursed energy are the sorcerers, and one of the strongest in Jujutsu Kaisen is Satoru Gojo. He uses cursed energy to help people and fight cursed spirits. Gojo can do a lot. He can basically take on any cursed spirit and a cursed user and easily destroy them. Thanks to Gojo's limitless and six eyes, there isn't anyone stronger, arguably only Sukuna and down the line Yuta. But the point is, Gojo, as powerful as he is, he can't help the ones that the Jujutsu world god kind of cursed, like Mekamaru. His body was frail and he was in pain all the time, but he had insane amount of cursed energy. I'm sure with all that cursed energy, he still would have loved to have a normal life or a healthy life at some point in time. Toji had zero curse energy, but there must have been a time or two he wished he had curse energy, especially the time when he was part of the Zenin clan and they were laughing and bullying him. That being said, there's one curse spirit that can help those who have been restricted by the heavenly restriction like Maki and Toji. That curse spirit is none other than our fun love and patch face Mahito. He was able to fix Makamaru's body and if he didn't kill him, Makamaru would have been on a day with Miwa by now. He could also give Toji curse energy and can heal anyone that has been injured. The only downside to Mahito giving curse energy to people like Maki and Toji is that they would probably be weak because what makes them strong is the fact that they have no curse energy.